guys, my mum is down and I thought if I could do like a little quick drama like a dog out of the missings and all of my happy times I had like a kid. Now first of all, when I was a kid I had my little brother at the air. Which was only like, when he was only like about three years old. Yeah, thanks mum. He was like three years old. And he liked to play with his little toys, and and of course there was there was me. He was like three years old, guys, and I. Was like an like a like a nine year old kid, so yeah, so I was playing with lots of stuff and, and I loved joking around a lot. Whilst I have my brother in there, he started crying out of nothing, which really made me annoyed and upset. Also, I loved telling stories. Now, one of my favourite stories that I loved telling is this. I was talking to my uh, uh, auntie And I was really chattative, I was really talkative, and I loved telling stories to my auntie, and even making silly stories up, like falling in a pot of jelly, and like in a pot of jelly, or getting lost in a pot of jelly, or falling and never hitting the ground, like you kind of lost, you see? That was one of my favourite times ever, guys, and and, and my favourite stuff ever for doing those still continues to this day and will never ever end. Also, I love drawing dots. I love drawing little colourful yellow dots. I love, love drawing colourful dots. D dots to count all of them unless you get lost in them. Later on, I really loved to tell a lot of stories that I finally thought if I can draw my own book of them. And that brings me to my newest video ever, my newest ever video that I've ever made. First ever video I have ever made on my every YouTube or YouTube channel, like only about a couple of likes. And that is Beano Annual Collection. There'll be a link down below. And my brain and my new collection video is probably one of my <coughs> favorite videos ever. I loved how that video produced me lots of likes, and I also and it was really a funny, really funny moment where I was playing lots of funny games. And had to count the dots, but accidentally I realized that I was going my wrong or a wrong route. That was really funny, and there will be a link down below. But I was just, just having to count all of them. Once I remove one, I can remove. And later on, there was a really funny moment where me and my Corinne, of course, yeah, I would tent, which we thought if we could camp outside, we were really happy actually. Started moving. We were screaming because of the wind, it was so strong, following towards us. Us kind of dotting the lov lovely things, and yeah. I love doing wonderful things like. like rope climbing. I loved rope climbing. Rope climbing was my favourite thing I ever did as a kid on the Lucero, yeah? I used to imagine myself. I used to have in the corner of my of a, of a like like a line thing, like a bar, pretending like I'm attached to some kind of rope so I never fall down, like on the bar. And I was actually thinking that, imagining that I was doing it on on a very high mountain, which was was all greeny and all snowing. 
I can never forget that moment in my life, and, and I'd love to, to joke around. I love being really, really silly to my auntie, and that was so fun. I was like joking around to make silly stories, or even sticking my, my, my tongue out, and I love being so happy. But I have never ended that because as I was being so silly, I, I, I thought that it would be quite funny. So eventually, I thought if I could, if I could tell some really funny jokes and probably make an animation about it. And that brings me over to my first ever funny animation that I could ever properly draw. And that is Dorian's Funny Animation Life. I was, a, I was yellow coloured and I was in a sea. In, in a sea. And when I was drawing this animation... But somehow I'm I'm thinking I'm seeing something, yeah, but it's actually just 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 a water from my eyes because I because I splashed myself with water. So that was too hot. Later on, it was so sunny that it was quite sunny. So of course I had to splash myself with water because it was so sunny and I was all alone. So that was the moment I decided to make my first ever. Animation ever on to share on Skype. You can't see it right now because it's on Skype. Man, Pam. I love joking around and cutting lots of tiny little dots. So tiny, and eventually that brings me to my new level. I was being so silly, guys, that. I'll try my best to do to see if I can um get like get like um fit and I was I was trying to like um a lot and yeah later on I I I was up on the thing in the fair which was like four hundred feet high with with the trampoline on the bottom and I had to jump my entire way. Down, down in it because I loved, I loved jumping around and I loved doing trick shots, shots and that was probably my favorite moments ever. Little dots, little, little dots in the end. Later on, my favorite thing were to eat was, I, I, we were going camping in a place called C O V O nine O one. And that, of course, brings me to my other book. So I wrote my very first ever book. Book ever, first ever book, book, guys. Guys, and I was obsessed with drawing books and even writing my very own stories. I sent online and even get, get, make it like a story. I eventually made my very first ever book story, but that took me like three days, three weeks to complete just to write one book to get finished my story. My first ever story that was ever sent online was on Snapchat and on and on my very, very, very old videos. Some of you probably don't remember that, but I probably if you haven't seen them, I have a YouTube channel. Of videos, lots of videos which just disappeared, and my long and lots of dozen videos since I was like a tiny little kid. So that I said, and my being a video, one of the first video guys on YouTube, I made tons of videos so my days before that, but kind of lost, forgotten at the time. Now, there are little dots, and I loved drawing mazes as well, like this. Can, can you warm up my thing? Please, I want to swarm up. Yeah. Yeah, I love guys drawing mazes. Drawing swarm mazes, we basically have to find your way around and make sure you never get lost and disappear. I love how I'll draw mazes and going inside the fold over here and going a new character here and drawing dots by dots just to find your way out in the character. Or in my writing, how I used to write my very own maze. 
A lot of my variant made it like that. <coughs> and that brings me to my nearest animation ever. <coughs> Called How to Draw a Swarm Mate. I had to draw a swarm mate. Peter got it amazing. Since my brother was like three and a long time ago. But later on, later on, when I was like 13 years old, or when I have a new channel, I decided to do creative things like magic, making things dis d d d d disappear. I decided to make crazy things disappear in magic, and even decided to make my very own where is Wally. Wally fit bit creepiest. Later on after that I continued to my new ever one being a video which was at 2014, which I did an earlier one and of course I love having my new other channels and my new elements. Oh, this is what brings me to my to my good new days about me having my own so called me on a tree. Me on a tree and me covered around with blue and white. Sometimes I love I love to, to, to I love to be so silly that I was like smiling to the top of my face, even just to make almost a circle of my smile. That was so great. Now, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. My life will always continue, and I will always tell more stories of me trying to get like fatter or me trying. To eat so much that I pretty much will never stop eating. That's how silly I was. And I even made a video about those silly things. But I have never uploaded them to YouTube. That was so and, and I promise also thought that was one of the funniest moments ever. Like, that was quite silly. I even know why I was even doing that. But even though I got more creative and I loved to, 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 to paint pages, like a background. Like, like there's a sky or this is a sea. And, and I just have to use my imaginations for it. Hope you hopefully enjoyed this video. And I, I will. See you later guys. And I also loved to make donuts. I loved to make um shapes like these and I used to love drawing swirling them around stretching them making them taller making them thin and so that's my favorite moment ever and I love doing that since I was a kid I also could edit my stink and mention drawing using paintings and also send posting them online but for now I want to thank you guys for watching and I'll see you later Bye guys, tomorrow, yeah, don't pick up, yeah.